a number of our people who need the land and that is what the ANC should be responding to. So the suggestion of the redistribution bill is a very exciting one. I think it is necessary. Um, and the reason is that while we're debating whether the state's powers to expropriate and to pay no compensation are strong enough, actually there's another question, which is the state has had powers to expropriate in the interests of land reform. It has had an obligation to provide equitable access to land for 22 years, and it has failed to do so. And so what the redistribution bill is about is saying we need to strengthen not the powers of the state, but the obligations of the state and the powers of citizens. So a redistribution bill would define what is equitable access to land. Now, it is very likely that equitable access to land will be defined as saying those who have the greatest needs must be given priority. The idea of um, a redistribution bill goes further than that and says that the idea is that there must be some accountability of the state to citizens about how it uses its available resources. So if you spend 100 million rand buying a farm for a single individual, and then you say no to a group of 50 landless farm workers, then the state must be able to account for how it came to that decision. But in fact, it's very important that we shift our attention away from restitution and towards redistribution. And the reason is, restitution is a very bureaucratically and financially onerous process that takes far longer than the redistribution process because people have to prove that they were dispossessed whereas the redistribution process is based on need and so this could really shifting our attention and providing opportunities for people who lodge claims to instead go through a redistribution process could help us to expedite the process